Hi guys, this is Girish Shalwani. Welcome to my YouTube channel, The Real Vlog. Today we will talk about five skills that will make you successful and rich in life. How many of you think the lack of money is a problem? If you think the shortage of money is a problem, you are wrong. The lack of money is just a symptom. The main problem is the lack of skills. And today we will talk about those five skills which will make you rich and successful in life. Now the first skill set that we will talk about is a time management. Manage and organize your work efficiently. That's how you would be able to save time. We all have 24 hours a day, 7 days a week and 365 days in a year. So how do we control time? We cannot control time. We can only manage time. And how do we manage time? We prioritize things that we have to do for the day. How do we prioritize these things for the day? I believe priority management is also known as self-management. If you are able to manage yourself properly, you know what I have to do today. This is the most important task that I have to complete for the day. That's how you will become successful. The first step to become rich. So you need to focus what you need to do. While doing priority management, you might not be able to complete all the tasks in one day. You might be able to just do handful of things. But trust me, those handful of things, if you do it with focus, with dedication, it will give you maximum results. Many people ask me whether we should do multitasking or not. Priority management is all about focusing on the task that you are doing and completing that particular task for maximum results. So that was skill number one, which will take you one step closer to become successful and rich in life. Now we will talk about skill number two, which is copywriting skills. Now as I go through each skills, I want you to do one thing. I want you to put a comment which skills you will be implementing in your life which will make you rich and successful now notice that i have said copywriting skills that doesn't mean that you should know how to write uh, proper english or uh, like you know with a proper grammar i'm talking about copywriting skill that is a different skill set altogether now who all made money during lockdown what were you doing sitting at home during lockdown uh, when I used to talk to my colleagues and my friends, most of them end up spending their time with their family, uh, watching Netflix or Amazon. However, there were few people with certain skills. They made money. Even during lockdown, they made money. Few people just handled corporate social media account. Few people wrote a script uh, probably for Netflix or Amazon with upcoming web series those people made money the reason why you could not make money during lockdown because you didn't have that particular skill so it is very important to have a copywriting skill if you have a copywriting skill or if you develop that copywriting skill that will take you one step closer to become successful and rich now that is skill number two now we will talk about skill number three leadership quality let me tell you something, business is a team sport, it is not a solo sport. So if you are a leader, you would be knowing the vision of your organization and that's what you will communicate to your team. The success mantra to become a good leader is to be a good communicator. If you are able to communicate a vision of an organization or a task for the day to your team member effectively trust me the result will be much more better it is very very important that you develop this leadership quality which will inspire and motivate your team and that's what will take you one step closer to become successful and rich in life so that was skill number three leadership quality now we will talk about skill number four which would be closing skills now when i talk about closing skills do you know what exactly closing skills is how do you use it so let me tell you how do you work on your closing skills where do you use it so when you have closing skills what do you do 
you close your potential clients you close your vendors you negotiate with them properly now what is required to have a good closing skills do you ask powerful question that is very very important so if you ask powerful question it will help you for a trial close so whenever you want to close the deal you want to negotiate or you want to close your vendor even your friends families you want to get your work done everything is known as closing skill before that you do a trial close so you know the mindset of that person that you would like to close now in closing skill one thing is very very important you should be confident about the product you should be very very confident what are you talking about if you have ability to convince it will help you to close and i believe closing skill is very very important if you know how to close you would be able to close anything for yourself and for closing skill it is very important to do a trial close just before you close the deal just before you are convincing someone about the product or probably something that you desire for it is very important to do a trial close and understand whether that person is interested in what you are saying so that is closing skills the skill number 4 now the last and final skill that we will talk about today is communication why communication is very very important and how it will take you one step closer to become successful and rich in life you see one fear that most of the people have is speaking to groups so they don't talk about their ideas their thought in front of other people and you know why they are worried the only reason why they are worried because they think they will look fool they will look stupid communication is very very important especially if you have any ideas any thought it is very very important to communicate and present that idea in front of the group if you look at great leaders what quality do they have they don't fear while talking they don't fear while presenting their ideas and thoughts they don't fear speaking to groups look at all top leaders mukesh ambani look at steve jobs what do they do they present their product themselves because they are very very confident what they have developed and the same confidence they pass on to their vendors to consumer and everyone in the organization and that's what takes them one step closer to be successful and rich in life knowing others is intelligence but knowing yourself is a true wisdom Now if you want to know how did I manage to buy my first home subscribe to this channel and wait for my next video I will tell you how did I made that happen